Now the FAA is investigating another flight scare as Southwest Airlines plane forced to make an emergency landing after this happened here. The engine cover ripped off just moments after takeoff. Now our Richard Solomon is live in our newsroom with more and Richard. This plane was actually en route to Texas. Well, yeah, Cleo, this plane headed for Houston was able to safely land back at Denver International Airport yesterday morning. But just for a moment, imagine sitting on that plane, imagine seeing all this happen in front of you. Now, during that flight, the engine cover of the Boeing 737 appeared to rip off during takeoff, then strike the wing flap. Now, no one was injured on that flight. And in a statement, Southwest Airlines is calling this a mechanical issue. Passengers recounted those scary moments. There are a lot of people who were really quite nervous. Lots of, don't take off your seatbelts. Uh, hopefully they're going to get us on the ground. They must be turning around. The pilots didn't really know what was happening. It was folks on the plane that sent the message. So had he not known, had he not been able to hear and understand what's going on, there's no telling what would have happened. So it's only by the grace of God that he got the message. Again, everyone on that flight, okay. But this follows a trail of Southwest malfunctions. Remember just a week ago, Southwest flight experienced an engine issue. That flight forced to abort takeoff in Lubbock after the crew reported a possible engine fire. Now the FAA is also looking into two other Southwest flights from March, which returned to their departure airports after experiencing engine issues. Obviously a story we hear will keep you updated on once we learn more. For now, live in the newsroom, I'm Richard Solomon. Do you? Richard, scary stuff.